All right, I see a rising up this week. Um, <laughs> Aries, never mind the noise in the back. We have children playing um, and men working. Okay, so there will be a little bit of noise. Um, yeah, which is why I have decided to do change the readings up a little bit, Aries, so that... Um, so that uh i can move a lot faster um aries what i am getting here right off the bat is that you know first of all i can sense some healing here um but at the same time i sit I, I can see the uh backdrop to this story here some of you guys um you know, be this a marriage or, you know, you have just been in a relationship with someone for a while. I see that that has actually um <sighs> come to an end here. Let me look at this. I'm getting a lot of information here. For some of you, this have come to an end. Because somebody has stolen your partner. And for some of you all have stolen the partner back. I can see here. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, some of you all, someone has stolen your partner here. But, you know, I sense that, you know, now some of you guys, Aries, you or someone else here, you know, you are, you making a comeback from this situation. You are recovering from this situation, okay? You know, it has, it's as if your feelings for this person has grown cold here this week. And a lot of you no longer feel some type of way about this situation coming to an end. Your partner moving on with someone else. Like it just doesn't seem to be bothering you as much this week. You know, with this person throwing you out and moving on. Throwing you out and stealing on, okay? You know, because I sense here that someone right here has really um, taken someone else's um, partner here or this person has moved on and someone else is not really bothered by this as much. In fact, they are, they are getting their own glamour back their own beauty back because this situation had just sucked the life out of them okay this relationship this marriage had just sucked the damn life out of them and you know what i'm also sensing here um aries is that because i can see someone going from ice in the sun melting the ice here i see it I'm, let me show you where i'm seeing it baby i'm, I'm seeing it I'm, the more i look at them the more they talk okay it's right here going from ice to the sun as the sun melts the ice you get your own confidence back your own beauty back and you know what someone else is going to want to come back okay hmm how about that all right <laughs> their ass is going to want to come back okay and they are going to feel some type of way you know they're going to feel some type of way about you moving on or you just feeling better about the situation and i don't think you're going to even <laughs> allow them the chance i don't think you're going to allow them the chance Aries. Yeah. I feel like there is a new it's a new day. I'm telling you because everyone all I see right here is someone going from frozen to melting by the sun 
and really just you see how like pale she look you can't really see like her makeup or anything like she just look but then when you look at this girl she just lit all up you know it's all kinds of life into her that's i i just i just can't shake this here that there is a coming to this week you know there is a coming to and you know i feel like it is because of this or shall i swap it and say because of this okay someone was not honest they were not fair they were not um even-handed they were underhanded and you know they really put someone in a spot here that they didn't want to be in or that was uncomfortable for them damn it it's cold outside you, you, you know what i'm saying it's cold it's cold but now this girl is making a comeback she's recovering she's being revived from the damn ice from freezing to death out here okay here she go right here okay <laughs> this is what she's going to be okay and then she will be the one breaking hearts okay talk about it and then she will be the one breaking hearts okay whereas you probably got one heartbreaker here right now in a way it turns someone else into a heartbreaker okay you know i hope that made sense i hope i explained that the best way um that the cars are speaking to me you know so i feel like definitely like somebody either stole away with a lover or a lover was stolen from somebody from a marriage for something and there has been a fucking comeback of there where somebody thought something was over it was not over and someone has went back or gone to and now somebody is hurt you know um there you go i hope hey i can i can i i can only pick up so much okay so aries in your um pre-shuffle what i could see from the pre-shuffle is that you know you are coming out of heartbreak um you are forgiving and moving on you are mending your heart you know and i could also see that you are not even talking to anybody you're not sharing your thoughts like you're not really speaking on on shit you know you just you moving on it's an internal move on though and that's probably where this damn glow is going to come from, okay? You or somebody else. You know, it's it's an internal thing, you know, working internally. And again, I feel like there is no showing off. There is no no talking, no no sharing your thoughts, no talking about your thoughts, no telling your feelings, no talking about your feelings with everybody or anybody. It's just like you know, I felt this sense, Aries, of someone not really like giving a fuck about working with anybody on anything about anything. OK, especially like a uh, um, water, air or fire sign. OK, <sighs> a water, air or fire sign. Oh, because I didn't show you at the bottom of the deck. We got the lovers here. OK the lovers here so water air or fire sign we got pentacle here on the table it could absolutely be a um um earth sign as well but i just feel like a hey, you or someone else like they no longer have time for like the bull crap you know just someone here is just like i'm just going to move on you know i'm just going to do the things that i do you know now i know exactly you know who what when you know has caused 
all of the distractions in my life, all of the problems that I'm currently experiencing in my life. Now I, I see that for what it is and you know what, it is what it is and I'm moving on. You know, and someone else may be like absolutely freaking baffled by this. I was picking up too in the pre-shuffle. It's like you or someone else was like putting in all the emotional work to make a relationship work. But somebody is saying no, no more. I'm not I'm not putting in that type of labor anymore for you, you know. And I feel like someone else is so used to somebody putting in all of the emotional work and working for them that now not only are they baffled, but they don't even they, they don't even have the damn skills to work for somebody else because it seems like most of the time people have spent time working for them. So they don't even acquire the skills to go after a relationship. Because they are so used to someone else pulling the emotional labor, okay? So the way that they are trying to rectify this situation, I could see, is like, it's coming off so damn unattractive. Like, ugh, what are you doing? That's not the way you handle this. That's not the way you handle me. And ultimately, somebody is just like becoming like more and more and more turned the hell off. You know, it's just pushing them farther away and it just keep like further leading to their demise in the situation, you know, because they already like don't know how to fight for a relationship. They never it felt like they never had to or at least it was at, it was always at a bare minimum that they had to because like the skill for it just didn't feel like it was there. You know, I also feel like Aries from the pre-shuffle that like you or someone else like may not even see like how the hell they are going to really totally like remove themselves from this situation. Like if this is a marriage, you know, because at the bottom of the um Oracle, we got oaths, you know, and that's why I'm saying like a marriage or like a long term relationship. You know, this is what we have at the bottom of the tarot and of the um Oracle. OK, you know, so um, I just feel like somebody, some of you, some of you, some of you, I was picking up on the pre shuffle that. You don't even know um, how you're going to like totally remove yourself from this situation. Never mind the lawnmower going in the back. Yes, there's me and working. <laughs> but you don't know how you're going to like totally remove yourself from this situation. But all you do know is that you no longer like have time for the bull crap and like life is just too damn short to be living this way, Aries. And you just burned the hell out, okay? I hope you guys can hear me. So I'm going to really quickly tell you the signs that came up in the pre shuffle. I remember Leo, Cancer, Pisces, Gemini, Scorpio, Virgo, Capricorn. <laughs> <laughs> Libra and Aquarius. Okay, Aries. I'm so sorry about the noise in the background, guys. So I will chit chat with you guys later. Obviously, this is going to have to be the last video of the day because it's going down right now. <laughs> Bye, guys.